The power, flexibility and affordability of remote distributed computing or cloud computing now allows existing and new software developers to provide consumer and business email solutions that are accessible from any computer or mobile device through a web browser. Webmail services now allow business owners and employees to access email in and away from the office whenever is convenient to them. But vulnerabilities still exist at the device, software application and user levels, requiring careful setup and management of webmail in any business. Here are some key things to consider when setting up and using a webmail service. Does every employee require access to webmail? Consider only allowing access to those working away from the office and likely to be responding to work out of hours. Implement a strict password policy within your business. Ensure strong and effective passwords are used and changed regularly. If available to you, use two-factor authentication when users log in to their webmail account to help validate their identity. Whilst many webmail services are accessed through a web browser, some have their own privacy settings that can be configured to the user's own requirements. Advise employees on any settings required by the company. As with normal email, webmail is also vulnerable through bad practice by the user. Phishing scams, links to malicious sites, etc. are just as dangerous in webmail, so employees should be made aware of this. And because webmail can be accessed from any web browser, Businesses may want to advise employees not to log in to webmail accounts on unknown public Wi-Fi networks and public or shared computers where viruses, malware and even key loggers might be present, without the employee being aware of the security threat. Webmail can be an effective business tool but should be treated with the same trust and security rigour as all other business ICT. For more information on trust and security in business, visit our website at www.ecrimewales.com.